And then all of the debris, um, the stems, uh, leaves, all of that will come through here. Uh. We'll get a big mountain of compost, basically. We'll get a compost company to come in here. Mm -hmm. And then the grapes themselves are just dumped down into here, nice. okay, into a bucket down there. Okay. Okay. So then, if it's red grapes, um, they go directly into tank with their skins on, right? Um, because when you think of red wine, all of the tannins, the flavor, the color, everything like that is coming from the skins themselves. Yeah. Okay? Yeah, yeah. So it goes direct into here. Our white grapes then will go, we take the skins off first, yeah. and that's that machine back there, that big cylinder. Is this one here? Okay, so there's a door here, we put the grapes in. This whole cylinder rotates, okay, and in the center of it is like a hydraulic pump that slowly, slowly, slowly expands, okay. pushing all the grapes to the side, um, and then all the juice just flows out here, is caught into a bin down there, and goes directly into the tank. Okay. Okay? Okay. So when it hits the tank, then it wipes the juice, for red, they've got the skin on it. Okay. okay. And then they start the fermentation process. Mm. So this right. is the process of getting rid of the skin, right? Correct. For the white wine. And the red. But the red, it comes after fermentation. Then you take the skins off, okay. and it goes into an oak barrel. Oh. Okay. And we'll go through that when we go back into that. But yeah, so the skins come off eventually of the yeah. red, but it's after the fermentation. Fermentation is the same. It runs about three to four weeks, so upwards to one month. Mm. Okay, that is in here fermentation. So that's again changing that natural sugar into alcohol. Okay. Basically, is what you do. Right? So red wine, the grapes first go there, like to ferment first, yeah, the first, and then goes there yeah. like, to get rid of the, like all those skins. All the skins. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So it's already fermented. Yeah. And that's right. Okay. So we're nine months in an oak barrel. Uh -huh. And I'll, I'll describe that in a minute. Oh, red wine. Uh -huh. So how does the taste like when um, when it is like in a barrel for a long time? It's so like it gets bitter or? Um, well, you can taste and try because this one has been nine months. Okay. The next one you're going to try has been 36 months.